So most famously, when directed by President Nixon to fire um, the special counsel, the prosecutor investigating Watergate, Richardson refused and resigned instead, as we all well know. If the president directed you to change those regulations and then fire Mueller, or simply directly fired Mueller, um, would you follow Richardson's example and resign instead? Uh, assuming there was no good cause? Assuming no good cause. Uh, I, I would not uh, carry out that instruction. Um, let me bring us forward to your 1991 hearing in front of this committee. Um, you explained at the time how you would handle um, the BCCI case, and ironically, Robert Mueller, the same individual, was at that point um, the head of the criminal division. And you testified that you had directed Mueller to spare no resources, use whatever resources are necessary, and pursue the investigation as aggressively as possible and follow the evidence anywhere and everywhere it leads. Would you give similar direction to Robert Mueller today? I don't think he needs that direction. I think that's what he's doing. Um, you also said at that hearing that Robert Mueller in that investigation had full cooperation, full support, and carte blanche. Could he expect a similar level of support from you as Attorney General? Uh, yeah, he, he will. As I said, I'm going to carry out those regulations, and, and I want him to finish this investigation.